Step 1. Making bulgogi. This is the beef for bulgogi. First, remove the blood from the meat with a kitchen towel. Bulgogi is a salt thing because it is cut by machines in Korea. If it is difficult to buy beef for bulgogi, you can buy a chunk of beef like this and cut it thinly with a knife. And cut it into bite-sized pieces. This is a Korean pear, peel the skin. and grate it with a grater. Pears give off a natural sweetness and help the meat become soft and delicious. If Korean pears are difficult to find, you can use other types of pears or apples. Add 2 tablespoons of sugar. First, mix so that the sweetness soaks in. Also add 3 tablespoons of soy sauce. Add 2 tablespoons of cooking wine. Add 1 tablespoon of garlic. Add a half a teaspoon of ginger. Put 1 tablespoon of sesame oil. Add 1 and 3rd teaspoon of ground pepper. Mix all ingredients well. Step 2. Preparing vegetables. Cut the green onions about 5 cm in length. Cut the bok choy in half. Cut the napa cabbage in half and cut it again three times. Let me cut the king oyster mushrooms. Cut the king oyster mushrooms in half and cut them into suitable size. Cut the bottom of the shiitake mushrooms. Cut the shiitake mushrooms into bite-sized pieces like this. And for the rest, I will add a beautiful knife slice for decoration. If you cut one side like this and the other side, it will look like this. Put one more thin slice in the same way. Then the shape will look like this. If it is inconvenient, just cut it appropriately and use it. Cut the carrots into pieces about 1 cm and use a knife to lightly make the top part in a cross shape and cut the round side flat like this in the middle of the flat side use a knife to lightly cut the outer surface then if you turn it gently like this it will look like this If it is difficult to cut, just cut it appropriately like this and use it. Food tastes good, but if it looks pretty, it tastes even more delicious. All the vegetables are ready. Cut the tofu into appropriate size and bake it in a frying pan. At this time, bake the front and back side over medium heat for 2-3 to two, three minutes. It's better to bake the tofu than to just put it in as the golden color is pretty and the tofu will not easily break. Step 3. Making the sauce Let me make a dipping sauce for bulgogi and vegetables. Add 2 tablespoons of soy sauce. Add 1 tablespoon of vinegar. Add 1 tablespoon of sugar. Add 2 tablespoons of water. And add 1 teaspoon of mustard sauce. It would be delicious if you dip vegetables and meat in this sauce. Step 4. Boil. Then I will put all the ingredients in the pot. Put the bok choy. Place the mushrooms as well. Place the cabbage as well. Place the green onions too. This is the glass noodles soaked in warm water. If you don't have these noodles, you can add your own favorite noodles. 
put the bulgogi the main highlight of the day. Also put in the grilled tofu. Put carrots on it too. And add shiitake mushrooms. You can put kelp stock in the bulgogi hot pot, but today I will simply pour hot water. Add about 3 cups of hot water, then cover and boil over high heat for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, loosen the meat with the chopsticks so that it doesn't clump and cooks well. When the meat is completely cooked, season it. Add a tuna fish sauce or fish sauce about 1 to 2 tablespoons. If you don't have tuna fish sauce, you can use soy sauce. Finally, delicious bulgogi hot pot is done!